Parading through history, the Absaloka Nation is a new traveling exhibit now being featured at the Western Heritage Center. What's significant about this exhibit is that it tells the stories of the Crow tribe from the perspective of the Crow people and shares items like this child dress made with imitation elk teeth. So this is a peyote fan made with owl feathers. The Western Heritage Center manages the largest traveling exhibit program in the state of Montana, and the exhibit now at the museum chronicles the rich culture of the Crow tribe. In the exhibit, you'll see information about the history of the people, about their transition from uh, a plains culture onto the reservation. It's also one of the few exhibits ever researched, organized, and designed from a Crow perspective. It features the thoughts of historic Crow leaders, artifacts, and contemporary information on who the Crow tribe is today. This was made more recently and, and uh, is shown off and is highlighted through parading. This contemporary leather and beaded landscape is one of many artifacts folks can check out. The exhibit includes information for women, for men, uh, history information, information about childhood. Uh, so it's, it's really a great snapshot of an entire culture. This banner captures a brief history of Chief Plenty Coup, the last traditional chief who lived to be bound by the borders of a reservation. We also have Chief Plenty Coup's life mask that was originally cast by the Smithsonian Institution in the 1880s. Hunley says the Crow people are also incredibly proud of their identities as warriors. And so many of them have continued to serve uh, in the U.S. military. And patrons can listen to the Crow language through documented oral history. We've chosen to play a portion of Winona Plenty Hoop's oral history. Uh, and it actually, she gave the interview in Crow. And folks can actually play a powwow drum when visiting the exhibit. The exhibit is open till October. So this is really allowing them the opportunity to learn more and to understand more about this really fascinating and amazing people. In Billings, Alina Howder, MTN News.